that didn't make any sense. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Mackenzie and welcome to my channel. So today I'm filming my first YouTube video and I kind of wanted to do a get to know me thing. I have written down 25 questions that I'm going to answer just so you guys are able to get to know who I am. Question number one, where are you from? So I was born in Darwin, Northern Territory in Australia, but I now live in Brisbane. Number two, do you participate in any sports? I do. I do competitive all-star cheerleading and I do it at Queensland Cheer League. Number three, what is your biggest fear? My biggest fear is snakes. I hate snakes. I can't stand snakes. I love literally every single animal, but I can't do snakes. Something about them just creeps me out. I can't look at them. I can't see them. I can't. <laughs> Thinking about snakes just creeps me out and I don't like it. And I was at school camp in grade 11, I think. I can't remember, but in school camp and it was at night time and Everyone knew that I hate snakes. I, I hate snakes. And it was at night time and one of my friends, he threw a headband on me and yelled snake and I just started crying and freaked out and everyone was laughing. And it was pretty funny, but it was so traumatizing for me. It was so scary. But that's a little side note, but I hate snakes. I hate snakes. Number four, what is your favorite drink? So I have three favorite drinks. I love Fanta, pink lemonade, and Pasito. What is your favorite food? Okay, I love food. I love food. I absolutely love food. I love McDonald's. I love Chinese food, Indian, Mexican, all of that. What is your favorite app? My favorite app would probably have to be Instagram. I love Instagram. I think Instagram is really cool being able to connect with other people, post photos. I love seeing other people's photos. I post heaps of cheer stuff, just random stuff. And I love all the different memes on Instagram, Instagram stories. I don't know. I just think Instagram is a really cool app. What was your least favorite subject in school? Okay. I hated maths and physics absolutely hated it. it was terrible at both of them just passed them just so i could get my credit points but i hated math and physics are you a good cook mm -mm 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 -mm. i cannot cook cooking actually like freaks me out a little bit my parents don't teach me how to cook because when i was little we had a two minute noodle incident and I forgot to put the water in with the two minute noodles and I kind of blew up the microwave. So my parents never taught me how to cook, so it freaks me out and I'm trying to learn, but I'm not very good at it. <laughs> what are your weaknesses? Okay, overthinking is definitely one of my biggest weaknesses and it's something that I'm trying to work on, but it's, it's getting there, it's getting there. Do you have any tattoos? Yes, I have one tattoo. I'll insert a photo of it right here just so you can see what it's like. It's have faith, but it's written in Italian. Um, this quote kind of, it really resonated with me, not in like a religious sense or anything. I'm not religious myself, but more so in just believing in everything you do and you do it for a reason. And if you're gonna do it, just have faith in yourself, have faith in your abilities and just have faith that what you're doing is the right thing. Do you have any pets? Yes. I have two dogs and a cat. I have Emma, Monty, and my kitten, Archie. Emma is a rescue dog, so we're not 100% on her breed. Monty is a pure chalk lab, and Archie is a rag doll. What is your star sign? I am a Virgo. And the next question, following that, what is your birthday? My birthday is the 27th of August, 1999. The next question is, what do you spend most of your money on? 110% food, or going out for food. The next question is how long have I been doing cheer for? So I started cheer in 2015 and it's 2018 at the moment. So this is my fourth year of cheer. What are some bad habits? Some of my bad habits would probably be I when I get stressed, I like bite like the corners of my nails. It's really bad and I like to get acrylic nails just so I don't do that so my nails can grow. Are you studying? If so, what? No, currently I'm not studying at the moment. So I graduated from high school at the end of 2017 and I went straight into university. I studied, I did a semester of sport and exercise science at QUT and I liked some aspects but I didn't like other aspects. And I feel like during high school, I was so set on, oh my gosh, I have to know what I want to do. But 
I felt like I had to go straight into uni. I had to know what I wanted to do and that's what I was gonna study for the rest of my life. So I decided to take this semester off and really focus on working, figuring out what I wanna study. And I finally decided that I really wanna study nursing. So hopefully I can get into that to start off next semester. If not at the start of next year, hopefully mid semester next year. Do you like coffee? Okay, I don't like coffee, but I've never tried like an ice, co like cold drink coffees. I've only ever tried like hot coffees and I don't really like it because I'm more of a sweet drink person, but I don't really like hot coffees. Do you have a nickname? I get called Maka, Ken's, Kenzie, anything really, but usually the main ones is Ken's or Kenzie. Do you cry in sad movies? Yes, I cry in sad movies. I'm a very emotional person. Like the tiniest things will make me cry. Like I am a crier and I bawl in sad movies. That's like watching a robot movie and I literally bawled throughout the whole movie. It was a robot movie and I was crying the whole time. And, and you know those crying that you cry like heaps and then you get the headache afterwards? Yeah. It was one of those cries. Do you have any medical conditions? Yes, I do. I have one and it's a pretty big one and it's kind of a hard one. I might do a video talking about it later on because I know a fair few people have it, but it's not really something talked about very often. I do have endometriosis. It's a female thing and unfortunately it was hereditary in my sense so my grandma had it and my mum had it and now I have it and unfortunately I have it at a very young age which is sad but I have a really good gyno and they're helping me so I'll let you know more about that when I do a full in-depth endometriosis kind of video. <laughs> what is the dumbest way you have hurt yourself? Okay I am really injury prone i hurt myself a lot i'm pretty clumsy i like trip all the time i counted one time walking to school i tripped over 27 times don't know how that happens but the dumbest way i've probably hurt myself is when i was in like kindy me and my friends were like the shortest people i'm quite short like i'm not that tall we were trying to fit on baby clothes and we got the baby clothes on because we were so little and then we we're trying to run around in baby clothes and i fell over and put my hand down and i snapped this finger in two places so it bent at that bone and then it bent again at the top bone so that was fun so don't try and put baby clothes on and then run around it's not a good idea what is your favorite movie your favorite movie changes all the time but i love the disney's i love everything i love b movie shrek i really like the hitman's bodyguard i watched it a couple days ago and it was really really funny i love moana i watch moana all the time sing to moana it's great but i love rom-coms comedies and disney or pixar movies do you have any hidden talents so i have my belly button pierced but before i got my belly button pierced i could like invert my belly button if that makes sense so i have an innie but i could like get it flip it and like push it out and the last question is a random fact about me. When I have a shower and I wash my hair, I abs like I try to not close my eyes under the water. I try to leave that for like the last little bit because I like freak out when the water's over my eyes and I can't see because I always have that fear in the back of my mind that I'm gonna finish washing my hair and then I'm gonna open my eyes and it's not gonna be someone standing there like staring at me. I don't know, it's weird, completely irrational, but that's a random fact fear that I have if that made any sense but yeah there were 25 questions about me and I really hope you enjoyed the video it's only my first video there are going to be a lot more videos to come make sure you comment in the description bar anything you'd like to see I'd love to hear from you guys don't forget to like and subscribe and also don't forget to hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button just so you guys are notified when I post future videos also go and follow my social media accounts Instagram and Twitter I post a lot on there and I use it as a really good platform to communicate with you guys. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed my very first video. Probably super awkward, but I had fun filming it. And I'll see you guys later.